Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So by the title of this video, you see that I will be doing a vlog camera review. But before I get started, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share with a friend. So, let's get into it. I finally decided to buy a camera so I can be so I can improve the quality of my my vlogs and improve the quality of my videos and I also needed a camera I've been vlogging for about two years now and I really needed an upgrade so currently you are seeing me on a JVC camcorder um, and I've been using that for the past two two and a half years but I decided to now buy a new camera because the quality is is low on this um, on this camcorder that I that I have so I got myself I'm not sure if you can see it. So this is a Lumix, Lumix FZ300, and it is by Panasonic. So I decided to get this camera, and I, I did my own little research. I asked a few questions. Shout out to my cousin King Danny on Instagram. Um, I asked her about you know cameras, what she thought about it, because she's very privy when it comes on to electronics. Um, so I I asked her about it. She said it's not a bad first camera. I also want to shout out Johnny. He's also tech savvy. So thank you you guys for you know for your opinions on me buying this camera. So let's go and unbox the camera. Alrighty. So here. Is my camera and at some point to the video I'm gonna switch switch out to this camera so here's the camera this is the Lumix FZ 300 again um, I like the style of it I like that it's easy to hold um, I did turn it on at one point um, but then the battery the battery was dying I didn't charge it or anything so I went ahead and I charged it um, so I'm about to just pop the the battery in right now alrighty so one thing that made me decide to get this camera is that it has a a pop-out screen so and you're able to turn it either ways that you you'd like to turn it also I'm able to get high quality um, videos from it um, and high quality pictures so in the box I also got a, a CD so I will be taking a look at it at some point I got a CD and then I had um, got the manual of course in, in Spanish and English so those I'm gonna check out um, but back to the camera oh and I forgot to mention I actually bought it on Amazon so if you know me well, you know that almost every electronic, every item that I need, if I don't go in stores, I'm going to get it off Amazon. So, this camera I got on Amazon. So, some details on this camera. So, it is, the screen size is 3 inches. It has image stabilization. It is 4.61 times 5 times 3.6 um, dimension. It weighs one and a half pounds. It's a 12.1 megapixel. It has optical zoom of 24 times. It has a video capture res resolution of 2160. And uh, the viewfinder type is electronic. Now I'm not sure what exactly the viewfinder is. Um, so that, I mean, I still have a little research to to do myself but I really you know shopped around I saw which one was the most economical for me um, which one could also give me the quality that I was looking for and this was my top pick I actually saw another camera that I really liked um, but it did not have the the flip out the flip out camera so the flip out screen sorry so that was why I decided to go ahead and purchase this camera instead of the 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 other option and it was also um, a Lumix camera so again it is easy to hold I really like how it feels in my hand it it has the zooms on the side so zoom v feature zoom features on the side um, it has focus on the side also um, and everything is right at your 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 fingertip so right everything is right at your index finger so the power on um, to change the, the different modes um, to play around with 
you know different different features of it as i said i'm very new to the to the whole camera electronics thing so um just at first glance i really like it it also is wi-fi compatible that's a really important feature it is wi-fi compatible and that's also why i wanted to to get it because instead of um plugging in things i can just liter literally send images send videos to whatever um electronic device that i'm going to um, use to edit so that was one of the features that i really like about it so now i think that's all i can say about the the camera right now i will be going out a little bit from now just to take some videos take some pictures off outside and see how it, how it works so right now I'm gonna switch it out and let's see how it holds up alrighty so we are back on the Lumix camera and I am loving how I see the screen right now it looks so much clearer but we'll we'll see the test once I upload it to my laptop and we can take it from there but some other things about the camera or some or the the um, accessories that I got so it came with one battery and a portable charger it comes with the I guess the 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 camera cover it comes with the camera cover and then I'm not sure exactly what this piece is for I have to figure that out. It comes with this piece. Anyone knows exactly what this is, what this piece is for, then let me know. But I'm not sure what this piece is. So it came with those. Um, what else? I also went ahead and just bought a, a, um, a camera case for it. And it fits perfectly. It's not the one that they recommended for me to buy, but this one was like, I want to say maybe $8 cheaper. And it looked like it would have fit more items than what they recommended for the camera. So I went ahead, I bought this, this case. Um, I don't remember the exact price, but I remember when I was comparing it, it was about like $8 less. And then, then I went ahead and I bought a camera strap. So I did not know that the, the camera was going to come with a, with a camera strap. So I went ahead and bought a camera strap. So I will be returning this um, cause the, the camera did come with one. So that's about it as far as um, just looking how the camera looks. I'm going to go outside as I said, um, do a little recording. I need to go do a little shopping also. And that's a surprise video that is coming to you guys. So stay tuned for the rest of the review for this camera.